guys i have another channel on that channel i upload videos in hindi this is the channel abhishek sharma you can search it on youtube right there are almost 286 videos and currently we have almost 15k subscribers on this channel guys i upload interview related videos on this channel you will get java interview series also i have uploaded a lot of subjects like cryptography in hindi and english both okay you will get quality management videos compiler design videos best playlist i'll say if you know hindi you will get the best explanation of cryptography and compiler design on my channel right there are some gate questions also amazon interview process i have also explained on this channel you will get c programming videos tricky c videos pointers in c guys this is one of the most important playlist interviews link list for interviews right i have explained all the programs in detail you will get some vlogs and you, you will get computer graphics engineering economics file handling and so on so guys if you know hindi do visit this channel i can guarantee you you will like the content so do visit once and do check this playlist okay interview process details if you know hindi and this is the best video till date so guys this is the most important video which i am highlighting right now this video will also be published in english very very soon it might happen that this video will be published within a day or two so do subscribe to this channel guys do visit this hindi channel so guys you will get the link of this channel in description or you can search abhishek sharma right so do check this hindi channel guys now let's start our english video hey guys what's up everybody i hope you are doing great today i'll be telling you how many languages should you know for your interview I'm getting this question a lot from the viewers on my Instagram handle so that's why I'm taking this topic today. So guys now let's start this video. There are many languages right? Python is growing very fast. We all know Python is growing very fast, okay? Java is also there, C++ is also there, right? So which language should I learn? Should I know all the languages in detail? Do they ask me every language in the interview? So guys we all know Python is growing very fast. But now also guys if you appear for any company test, they'll not give you the MCQs of Python, right? at this current point of time they'll always give you the multiple choice questions of c c++ or java okay if they are hiring for java developer role or something like that then obviously guys there will be mcqs related to java right and if they are hiring for any post in general they'll always contain the mcqs small small code uh, snippets for c also and sometimes c++ as well okay so this is the scenario most of the time c and c++ mcqs are there in various companies java mcqs are also there in some of the companies but and guys python mcqs are not asked in most of the companies if you are appearing for a specific company and they are uh, hiring for python developer role that's a different scenario guys okay in that scenario they might ask you uh, mcqs related to python but in general if we talk in general if you are appearing for a interview then you should know guys any of one object oriented programming language that is you should know either python or java or c++ right let's keep c apart if you are from c side or any other background if you are into coding c should be known to you okay that is a basic funda you should know c and guys for your interviews you should know either java either c++ or python i am not saying that if you know java very well don't study c++ or python you should know the basics of all the languages but you should be a master of one because for an example if you know c++ very well if you know all the concepts like how objects are created what is the concept of object oriented programming okay what are arrays and so on so guys the concept is same in all the languages only the syntax differs right so that's why if you know any of the language that is sufficient for getting placed but the thing is you should know the basics of all the languages okay i'll suggest you you should know basics of all the languages if you are in your first year or second year right just explore all the languages and whichever language you like just stick to it and do programming in that language only okay because guys if company is coming to your campus for hiring process you will solve the coding questions in only one language okay you will be allowed to use any one language for your coding interviews right so guys suppose for an example any xyz startup company is coming to your college for interview placements so they'll give you suppose two questions and you will have one hour to solve those two coding questions so you can either solve it in java python or c++ whatever you feel like so you should be master at one language and you should know basics of all the other languages okay so that's the main thing about how many languages i should know for interviews now guys one more important thing suppose for an example if your company is coming for the post of web developer right front end developer or back end developer okay back end developer or they are coming for full stack developer okay full stack developer so what you are supposed to is you should know the languages which are used for web development like guys you should know bootstrap you should know javascript there are many frameworks of javascript guys for an example you have your node js okay you have your react and so on okay 
So guys, these frameworks Node.js and React.js, they are getting very popular. If you are new to the programming world, do explore these things, okay? First of all, learn HTML, CSS, then go for JavaScript. And then guys, you can learn all these things in detail, okay? You can search for any video on YouTube or Google, like how to start web development. You will get a lot of videos, right? So that's it from this video. You should know only one language. You should be master of one language and you should know the basics of all the other languages, right? So that is sufficient for getting placed in any company.